What's going on guys, go back to another episode. If you've been watching this channel, you know that I have been uh, playing around with the Creative Pebble, like the V2 and the 2.1 and things like that. Well, I guess Creative saw that and they reached out to me and say, hey, we got some new ones coming in called the Pebble X. If I want to try it out, I say, I say heck yeah. I mean, I love Pebble products, so uh, yeah. So here it is. The Pebble X just came in yesterday and uh, we're gonna unbox this thing. Let's do a little sound test on this as well and see how good it is, all right? So needless to say, this is a uh, sponsored video from them. They did not pay me to uh, do a review on this, by the way, they just sent me the product for free. And so I'm sharing it with you guys right now. Let's do it. Quick start guide, uh, 3.5 millimeter jack auxiliary ports. I'm assuming that this thing has it because uh, since there's that cord. By the way, I don't know anything about this speaker. Brand new product. It's not even on Amazon yet as of this video. So USB-C to USB-C. So it looks like they're sticking with the whole USB-C thing. Oh, there's two USB-C cords in here. So yeah, I have not like read up on anything about this speaker at all. So this is pretty much my first impression. Do have a 2.1 version as well that's coming out for this, but they don't have it yet, so they can't send it to me. So first off the bat, I think these are slightly bigger than the older ones. Yeah, they're, I think they're slightly bigger than the older ones. Look back here, two wire attached. So this is the main speaker right here. It has the uh, headphone jack, which is nice of them to do that. And also a mic port as well so in case um, you can plug your gaming headset into this if you want to auxiliary port which is what we were talking about earlier with the 3.5 millimeter jack then there is a uh, USB-C for PD which, which is powered and then there's USB-C which is to connect straight to your computer and so I'm assuming that this thing uh, takes up a lot more power that's why it needs its own power delivery method which that's the reason why you see two USB-C to USB-C here. Oh, and uh, this is interesting right here. Uh, you can actually mount this on a tripod stand or on a speaker stand. That's why these are here. Yeah, so that's a tripod mount right there. I call it a tripod mount, but I'm sure the speakers mount use the same. Yeah, so it um, looks like it's a little bit more powerful than uh, the other ones I have. The, Part of the reason for the size increase as well. Got a Bluetooth button right here so you can connect to all your Bluetooth. Obviously this is the volume button and when you press in on it, uh, I think that might be mute if you press in on it. And then there's the lighting button which, oh yeah, uh, I believe this has uh, some lighting around here. I'm not sure you can see that or not but you can kind of see through it a little bit with, you know, right there. So yeah, we're gonna test that out as well. So let's go ahead and plug this one in. Okay, so uh, I've got everything set up right here. USB-C is connected, but we already know that it's gonna work with a computer, right? So, I mean, you just plug USB-C into a computer and it should work, uh, which is what all the Pebbles have done. But I wanna, I, wanna, I wanna test out my iPhone, okay? I have an iPhone 15 uh, Pro Max, and so it has USB-C port on there. Since it's a USB-C port, I just wanna see if I can just plug it in and just play music off of it, right? Without using Bluetooth. Obviously, you can use Bluetooth on this. So, we already know that. But, yeah. So, here we go. Oh, wow. Okay, so uh, check this out. It is working because... Look at the meter volume, the volume. I'm, I'm, I'm turning it and it's reacting it on the phone itself. That's cool. Okay, let's do another song. 
one of my favorite. Okay, so there you have it guys. That is the uh, test for the Pebble X. Um, I'm not sure how many watt this is, but I'm using a 30 watt cord to power this thing up and then I just plug it into my phone. So just an FYI on that. These cords that comes with it looks really thick and so I'm pretty sure that it's uh, delivering data and power at the same time. Pretty good cords. Um, lighting, when I turn off my lights, that looks fantastic, by the way. It's not the brightest light, uh, you know, like RGB-ish light like these up here, but it's, it looks great. Uh, the diffused on this that they've used around this, it looks great. Yeah, it looks really good. You can see that it's shining through like the black cover surrounding this. Looks great. Um, the base, it's not the heaviest base out there, and that's probably the reason why there's a 2.1 version out there. Um, I can't wait to get it in here. Uh, hopefully, they'll send it to me. I, I've requested it, but uh, stay tuned. Yeah, but this one right here, Pebble X, just came out. Hope you guys enjoyed that uh, little test that I did, and I'll see you in the next one.